leave a message after the tone. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am basically taking apart my bedroom. If you guys haven't been watching my moving vlogs or you just didn't know, I basically am moving house and this week I have been tearing apart my bedroom. I have a little bit more left to do but I needed to film the intro before I do that. This video is literally going to be me decluttering, organising, taking apart, packing my whole bedroom up and it's so strange. I have had this bedroom ever since I started this particular YouTube channel. I lived in a previous house where I did my old channel but this this channel was born in this room and the fact that in like three days I am going to be leaving this room forever is very very sad. So I wanted to film it and document it just so I can kind of look back on it and obviously I have so much to look back on anyway from what I filmed in this room but it's so weird because this is the last ever time I'm going to be sitting down and talking to the camera whilst I'm here. It is so sad but then I'm also so excited because we're going on to new and bigger things so you've got an empty house all coming, you're going to get a room tour of my new bedroom you've got so much more to look forward to and this year is going to be incredible and it's onwards and upwards i hope you guys enjoy if you do please smash a huge thumbs up and other than that let's get into the video <laughs> The day has come to finally start doing my room. I'm stressed. I have so much to do. So first of all, I'm just going to show you what the current situation, well, the current state of my room is. It's awful. And I literally can't believe I'm about to show you guys this. We're not going to judge me. Um, This is what my room currently looks like. Now, I'm not going to lie. I kind of gave up on tidying it once I found out I was going to move. This is definitely the worst part because my wardrobe is full and I have no more room for clothes so I've just been accumulating this lovely pile of stuff here and then this well I just have no words and everything I mean up here looks nice but like this part of my room like when you walk in and see this it's just like an Anna absolutely not so that is today's task we are going to organize this and my wardrobe and possibly take this down and basically just get a start on this room i've got my roll of black bags ready basically what i'm going to do is i'm going to organize all of my clothes into two different piles obviously i've got this lot in here and then i've got a wardrobe full of clothes as well one pile of clothes that i'm going to keep and one pile of clothes that are going to go to either my friends or the charity shop that's what i'm going to do first and then all the ones that are going to either friends or charity shop are going to go in these black bags and then clothes that I'm going to keep are going to go in these two different boxes here. Although I'm probably going to need a couple more than two boxes. I just took out all of the clothes from my wardrobe and I actually just broke my wardrobe. Um, what am I going to do? <laughs> The piles are coming along. This is the pile of charity shop stuff and down here is the pile of stuff that I'm keeping. Still haven't gone through all of this and I've still got this pile to go through but we're getting there. The final two piles, I am stuck under this one and then the pile that is going to the charity shop. It's so big. <laughs> This is the first lot of black bags that are going to be going to my friends, charity shop, wherever. And now we're going to pack all of the clothes that I want to keep into these different boxes here. And now the clothes that I'm keeping are in this box and in this bag here. And now I'm just going through all my underwear and all of my shoes. And then we've actually pretty much cleared the majority of my wardrobe, which feels so good. That's a massive weight lifted off my shoulders. And then my next tackle is to take this down and put all my memories in a little box. And then I'm probably going to save it until I another day but then do all of my beauty stuff which is gonna take a while and this black bag and these two boxes are the final bits left from all of those clothes and I've just got my current handbag down there so in this one is all of my underwear and then all of my shoes and then in this one is clothes shoes like little rounds and bits and then that's all like more clothes big stuff like coats and jumpers and everything but that is everything so on moving day now I can literally just pick all those up and they are ready to go now I'm organizing my memory boxes and my memo board and I just found these two photos so if you're wondering what my room used to look like maybe like three years ago this is literally it I used to have it really really pastel I had a completely different dressing table area like if you've been watching my videos for a long time you will definitely recognize all this but how crazy that my room used to look like this I used to keep it so tidy as well I'm literally so ashamed of myself but new room new start <laughs> Thank you. 
this bag is now full of all of my memories and my photos from my memo board. I cannot even tell you how many memories and how many pictures I've just sat and I've just looked through and it's almost like really sad because this is genuinely like an end of an era but it's also really happy so oh I just feel really weird now I've took that down. It is empty, I've cleared the whole board so now this can come down. As an improvement on earlier, I feel like we're doing pretty well, I'm not gonna lie. Next up is my Alex drawers. Now, I'm not gonna lie, these are absolutely rammed with makeup. I have new organizers for all of my Alex drawers, but I just haven't been able to set anything out yet because there's literally so much makeup in each drawer. And I mean, in all of these drawers as well, I've just got so much stuff. So it's time to organize all of these and go through what I'm actually gonna be keeping. And the top of it as well, like the top is so messy. I don't even have anywhere to put my like Morphe James Charles palettes. I've just got loads of perfumes, like random lip balms and stuff. Just stuff that I just don't need anymore. And here is three of my drawers emptied onto my bed. Now I need to go through all of the dates of these products and find out which ones I can keep. And then the ones that I'm gonna keep, I'm just gonna pop in my Alex drawers. And then I need to go out and buy a box that I can transfer them all in to the new house. Now I've organized the drawers. So all of the stuff that I'm gonna be keeping is now just loose in these drawers. And I've also popped the perfumes in from the top of my Alex drawers as well. And then in here is just the pajamas that I'm gonna be keeping. But now on top, I've literally just gotta fit my palette in my makeup drawers which I'm going to organize now and then I'm just going to keep my candle and then I've just got two lipsticks oh and some eyelashes that need to go minus the James palette this is a lot of the makeup that I either won't use or has expired so again some of my friends are going to come on and have a look at this but the drawers are a lot more empty compared to what they were like I can actually open the drawers now so hopefully when I pack all this stuff up and put them in my new Alex drawers we will be able to fit I've actually got rid of quite a few palettes because I just don't have room for them anymore and I also need to go through the lipstick layer underneath this because this is like my everyday lipsticks and then underneath is lipsticks that I don't really wear that much but I do want to get like a holder to put on top of my Alex drawers my new ones to hold all of these lipsticks because I want to display them because they're so pretty <laughs> let you know that it is absolutely freezing today i don't know if you can see my breath in the car wait it's cold we have arrived for me it's the second time within a week here is our breakfast here's a sneak peek to my wardrobe that i got oh god it's another thing that i've got to put together i don't know where i've put it i've got everything i wanted <laughs> apart from the clothes rail i've literally only gone around one section and my basket is already full I'm now back from Ikea and Primark. I have done a haul in my moving vlogs if you guys want to see what I bought. But it is time to declutter the underneath of my bed. This is currently what it looks like. It's not too bad. I mean, there's basically loads of boxes behind these white boxes. But it's just really dirty and I just need to go through everything. Like, this is where I keep all like, my files and stuff. I've got this box to go through and there's definitely some stuff in here that I'm going to be binning. I just realised you could see me in the mirror. Wow, I look really good from this angle. <laughs> I'm just about to start organizing this box and I actually just wanted to show you guys that this box is filled with different things that you guys have drew me when you've been at Summer in the City or sent to my PO box. I literally have kept everything and this box is filled with all of it. So I'm just gonna go through and organize it all so it fits in a little bit better, but thank you guys so much because genuinely it means the world to me. This box is literally filled to the brim with loads of letters from you guys. And then I've just found my old Polaroid, my corsage flower thing from prom and I found my old iPhone for like i literally want to charge this up so bad i'm pretty sure we have an iphone 4 charger and i'm gonna see what photos are on here then maybe i could go through it for a video first box has been it condensed down i've actually managed to fit these boxes inside here i just repacked it and i had this massive gucci box inside this box as well i think i'm actually going to display this like i don't even know where but i just think it's too nice not to display and yeah i am going to be one of those girls that displays their gucci box i'm sorry <laughs> I 
just hoovered out this box from under my bed and I've just swapped over and put all of like my electrical stuff in here. Chargers, spare chargers, camera chargers, camera, boxes, iPad, my Nintendo Switch. I just found out my autograph book ready for when we go to Disney from the video where I surprised my mum and I'm so excited. Look, I've got like some stickers in there. I've got our passes from when we were in Florida like through four years ago now. Yeah, four years ago. And I have this, which is the backdrop that I had to take photos on when I had my 100k party. And just like that, I have actually managed to get the majority of my stuff into these two white boxes, these two little white things here. And if you go right underneath, you're going to be able to see there's some cardboard boxes back there. There's five of those. So all of my memories and just bits that I need to really like keep and like office work and stuff is all now organized and ready to go in the moving van. Perfect. That is another two bags of rubbish ready to go and cleared out of my room. Now I've basically got these big three shelves. I'm not really going to be taking much of this with me. Like I'm going to take my award from somewhere in the city, my two YouTube plaques and the odd bit. But honestly, like the majority of this is going. So now it's time to pile all this up and then I'm going to ask mum if she wants it. And then if not, it's going to the charity shop. <laughs> And apart from my dream catcher, that is everything off my walls. I'm not gonna lie, this is so sad. Like it's literally the end of an era. And I like, even though I'm so excited, this is so weird. It is now Monday, it is three days until we get the keys to our house and five, six days until we officially move in. But today is the last day that I'm gonna be taking apart my room because I'm basically going away to London <laughs> literally until the day that we move. So I've got to pack everything away. Here is what it currently looks like. These bed sheets have got to be binned or charity shop because I can't use them anymore. I've got a double bed now. I need to basically strip all of my bed in a second and I need to tidy all of this up on here. I've still got like loads of stuff on my shelf that I need to go through and then I've just got some other little bits and that's basically it. This is literally crazy. Oh my God. There's literally barely anything left in my room. Like all I've got to do is take the pillows off my bed and we are pretty much done. This is the end of my bedroom. Everything is now taken down. How crazy is this that like my whole bedroom is actually finished with? Like I've done my whole, like I can't believe that I'm never gonna see this room like set up again. It's so strange. Now I've just gotta wait until moving day. Luckily I'm not gonna be here. I am gonna be in London, but we're literally as soon as I get back, it is move. We're moving for like four days actually. We've got like one main moving day, but then we've got days where things are being delivered at the new house and things are like being set up and everything. So it's basically gonna be a long process, but that's the end of this room. So I've gotta sleep in here one more night without anything. I'm literally just gonna sleep in here with a blanket and then that's it. This is so weird. That is the end of the video. I really hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, please smash a huge thumbs up. I'm so excited to show you our new house and my new bedroom. Genuinely, you guys are going to love it and there's so much to look forward to. I love you all so, so, so much and I will see you on a Sunday at 10am for a brand new video. Mwah. Bye!